Hey, welcome to Beauty G. It's the third form in Wing Chun and it's got a lot of sequences, a lot of awesome moves that you can use. So let's get started. Beauty G starts with your natural stance, just like the first two forms. Just stand up tall with your chin tucked and your feet slightly together and with the string, pulling your head up towards the sky so you're nice and straight. Okay, from here, we're going to drop your knees slightly, about a couple inches. And we're going to pull our fists towards our chest at the sternum, sternum level. Put our, pull our shoulders back and down. And the fish should be almost flush against the chest. So you don't want to be st sticking out here. It should be fairly flush on your chest. Okay, from here, we're going to open our stance. Toes out, heels out. And like I mentioned in some of our other videos, the toes must be pointed inwards. Make sure they're not pointed outwards. So anything between 90 degrees pointing straight to 45 degrees pointing inwards will be good. So whatever is comfortable for you. So this is comfortable for me, somewhere in between. So you don't want to be more than 45 degrees than just a very big stance. And you definitely don't want to be outwards. That's not for this purpose. So somewhere like this. Okay, so once you have this stance, we're going to do our circle step or huma. So starting with your left foot, Tracing with your toe and go slightly past the center and then do a circle and go back to where you started. Now do the same thing with the right. Okay, so we're going to shift our weight to our left so I can lift my foot with no problem. Okay, shift it to the left, do a small circle past the center line slightly and then back. And now we're back to where we started. Alright, so that's called the hunma. Now we're going to do our double downward cross block. All right, and then we're gonna see, notice that the left hand is up on top. So now we're gonna do a double back fist. So from here, the left hand goes to the inside, and then now we do a back fist. And now we'll pull back to our chest area. All right, so we'll call that Wing Chun BG, um part one, set A. Okay, so one A. So let's start from the beginning. So we are in our natural position. Drop, okay, and then open, stance, and then circles, cross block, and then double back fist, and then we're back to here. Alright, so that's part 1A. Let's uh, go on to the next video. Alright, so we ended up in this position. So from here, we're going to do a burden punch with our left hand, our left fist, straight up. So instead of we're going to the center and out, we're going to go straight from our hand position here, beside our chest, straight up to vertical punch. After vertical punch, open up your palms so it faces up, do a wrist rotation or hand rotation to the inside, towards the inside. So here's your inside and the outside of your arm. So you can go towards your inside and then now point your fingers to my left, which is outside. Okay, from here we're going to move our fingers back and forth to the right and left. So, right, left, right, left, right, left. Right? Try not to move your hands, I mean move your arm while you're doing that. You don't want to be moving your arms or your shoulders or your elbows. Try to keep your whole arm up to your wrist um, in place while you're only rotating from the wrist and moving your hand. So from here, move just the hand and rotate the wrist three times. Now we're pointing back to the left. You're going to rotate it down, so your uh, fingers are pointing down, and doing the same thing, going up and down. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Okay, from here, you're going to rotate again with our palms now facing up. And that just completes the uh, EG exercises. And we're going to do a hyun south and back. Now let's do it with our right hand. Right hand goes directly from the side of the chest to straight punch position. Open it up, palm faces up. Do a circle going inwards and then now fingers are pointed to my right or to the outside. Do left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right three times. Rotate downwards. Do up, down, up, down, up, down three times. Rotate the palm facing up. Now do the hinge cell and pull it back. Alright, so let's just do the whole thing. Uh, this part. Uh, part 1B, so starting from here, 
straight punch, palm up, rotation, one, two, three, rotation, one, two, three, rotation, do so, and back. Straight punch, uh, palm up, rotation, one, two, three, rotation, one, two, three, rotation, in south, and back. All right, so that's part 1B, let's continue. Okay, so from the last uh, sequence, we ended up in this position. From here, we're going to do three kap jang, or three elbows. All right, we're going to start with our left elbow. So, left elbow, right elbow, left elbow, that's three kap jang. And now I'm facing directly to my right. All right, so some quick pointers is when the elbow comes uh, up, your elbow is coming up, but your hand is brushing near your ear. When it comes down, it ends around chest level, and your shoulder is down. All right, and your hand is relaxed. Okay, so when you do the right, same thing, hand comes up near your ears, and then the elbow comes down around chest level with your shoulder relaxed. Notice that there's actually two elbows when you're doing this elbow. It's when you're coming down, there's this right elbow, but look, there's another elbow that goes back at the same time. So after your first one, your second one will have two elbows moving at the same time. The one going up and down, and there's one that goes, rotates back. So the enemy is behind you, that's your attack. One, two, three. Okay, so that's doing it with double pivot. With the pivot, um, so the pivot is going to your right first, left, right. Okay, so this is your 80-20 stance, and your feet are 45 degrees this way, but your body is actually 90 degrees this way. Okay, one, two, three. That's just with the rotation. So um, notice that I can spin or rotate on the middle of my feet. Ideally, you want to rotate in the middle of your feet. But depending on what kind of surface you have, sometimes it's too grippy, your shoes are too grippy, you can't rotate in the middle, do your best, um, or you can start by just rotating on your heels, which is not ideal, but you can still get that motion. Okay? So, let me repeat. So you want, ideally, rotate in the middle of the feet. Okay? So if you combine the two movements, the pivoting and the elbows, it'll be one, two, three. Okay, so now I am facing my right, and now we're on my 80-20 stance, okay? So, let's just stop there. Okay, so we ended up here. What we want to do now is put our right hand, slide it, and now place it underneath your left elbow. Alright, from here we're going to um, extend it out straight to a VUG, right to the eye level while our left hand uh, becomes a musa. So you might see it clearer from this angle. So uh, this is where we uh, started. We're going to put this underneath our left elbow. This shoots out as a buji. Our left hand turns from here into a musa. Now notice that my musa is not at the center of my chest anymore because now we are facing this way. Even though my body is now facing that way, I mean, my chest is uh, facing 45 degrees, but my um, my direction is this way. Okay, so because if you put your hand over here, that's not your center line. Your center line is now moved here, so we put our hand here. Okay, so from here, we're going to put our left hand under our right elbow, take a small step with our right foot, then uh, move with your left foot and right hand at the same time. Okay, so from here, left foot, We'll come up to our right foot, and left hand will go up to our right hand. Okay, from here, open up your palms upwards, do the double hinge south, pull them back, and front. Okay, so if you're going this way, let's do the whole thing. So from here, hand under the elbow, view G and Wu Sao. Okay, put our hand underneath our right elbow, small step. Okay, both. Left hand and left foot at the same time, palms up, in south, pull back, drop, and the next part will be to do a hyun ma back up here. Okay, notice that from here, I'm going to do the circle, 
Make sure that the foot goes back to where, where you started. Make sure that the toe is not pointing that way or straight. It should be pointed inwards because that's where we're going to go. So shift our weight back so that we can easily move this foot. Okay, so do the circle and back to our position. And the same thing, we don't want to have our feet pointing that way or straight. It should be pointing inwards. Okay, so now we started back here. So let's do, uh, let's do that whole session uh, continuously. So uh, right hand under left elbow, beauty Ti Wu Sao, small step, left hand under right elbow, and a double beauty, palms, Wu Sao, double Wu Sao, and drop, and pull your hands back, and then uh, pin up. Okay, now we're going to do the whole section with our right elbow first. So one, two, three. Now we have our put our left hand under right elbow. Okay, pivot so and move so. Okay, small step. Put our right hand under left elbow and both right hand and right foot. Palms up, double pivot so. Pull back and drop, and then pivot up. Okay, back to our original position. Now section 1D, we ended up back here. We're going to do our left elbow again, same as before, but instead of doing our BUG, we're going to do a right palm uh, towards the chin area. And our right hand, sorry, this is left palm with our left hand. And then our right hand will be coming back as a fist. So you're going from this angle, you're going to have this, 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 and left palm with our right fist back here. Okay, so from here, uh, we're going to do a fox out. Okay, so notice that only one foot pivots. So fox out, I'm looking straight this way, and then this is at the eye level. From here, relax the hand, move it horizontally to your center, and from here, you're going to drop down to a jump out. Okay? Okay, so the action and the power come from the elbow. When you look from the side, it's actually one. Down. Okay? So don't go down. Actually from dropping the elbow. Okay? Drop the elbow. So after a fox out, come back horizontally, drop the elbow. Here, do it to the south. Okay? Palm up, to the south, and back. Now we do the right side, right, okay, so from here, we're going to do a high palm with our right hand, and go from here, high palm, right hand, and left hand back to the chest, we're going to pivot one foot, okay, and fox out, I'm still looking this way, and then hand comes horizontally, and thumbs out, and toots out. Okay, now we repeat. But now instead of doing a high palm, we're gonna do a low palm. Okay, this palm goes to the ribs. And notice that this angle is slightly higher because the ribs are like this. Okay, so you want to go into the ribs and attack with the bottom edge of your hand. Okay, so around here. Pivot right. one foot and do a fox out again. Hand, relax your hand, and come to the middle, and then do the thumb south. Drop the elbow, do the two south, and circle and back. Now do the right elbow, low palm, back out, horizontal, hand relax, thumb south, and then two south. Circle and back. All right, so it's pretty simple. Let's just repeat that. Left elbow, uh, beauty, okay. High palm, box out. Just horizontally across, down, to south. Circle, back. Right elbow, okay. High palm, box out. So I'll be down, uh, down, jump south, to south, and back. Now we're gonna go left elbow, same thing. Alright, 
low palm this time. Box out. Relax the hand. Drop it. To south. And circle. And back. Right elbow. Easy Wu south. Low palm. Box out. Uh, cross. Thumbs out. To south. Circle. And back. Okay, so now we're back to the distance position. So now we finish the first section of beauty. Alright, so let's just stop here and then let's do a review of the first section of beauty. We have four sections, A, B, C, D. So 1A, 1B, 1C, 1D. Okay, let's just do the whole thing from the start. Okay, and then I'll let you follow by. We're going to start with our relaxed natural stance. Drop. Open up stance, circle, set your center line, double back fist, pull back. Uh, vertical punch, rotations, one, two, three, down, up, two, three, rotation, palm up, yourself, back. Right punch, palm up, rotation, one, two, three, down, one, two, three, palm up, rotation, and back. Okay? Now we're going to do our elbows. One, two, three. Usao. I mean, beauty uh, usao. Small step. Double beauty. Palm up. Usao. Drop. And back into our stance. Okay. Right. Left. Right. Usao. Double. Drop. Back into our stance. Okay. This time only one elbow. Small step. Okay, drop, back to our stance, one right elbow, drop, back to our stance, one left elbow, high palm, box up, jumps out, to up, stand right, okay, high palm, box out, jumps out, to up, left elbow, Okay, low palm, half south, uh, thumb south, to south, right elbow, low palm, half south, jump south, to south, half to south. Okay, back to our starting position. Okay, so that's section one.